Hey guys, it's a little black book, you know what time it is. Yeah, I know it's late in the, it's late in UK. I know you can see the time in the corner. Um, obviously we've just seen a Kanye West um story that's running through. Um, I know Daily Mail is probably not the most reliable source to use, but um, there's this has been going around around the news articles for a little while anyway. Um, for the last few hours, so just reading the headline. Um, Kanye West says he's at peace if Kim Kardashian divorces him because she brought North into the world. As Kim stays quiet about the rally on social media, um, this is also in conjunction with a story about um Kim. Um, Kanye talking about obviously almost aborting their daughter as well. So uh, before I go any further, make sure you like, share, subscribe. I hope you like these videos that I'm doing, which is short, sharp and quick. You're not going to see my face in it. Um, but make sure you join the Mineral Grand. Grab yourself a little hoodie. Or grab yourself one of the shade hats as well. Use a little black but 91 as a code to get 10% off. Guys, all right, let's get into the video. I don't want to waste too much time. Um, so um, Kanye, obviously, if you watch my other video, I kind of a bit, a bit of banter, a bit, a bit of lightness and everything like that. But this is a serious one. I want to just be serious about it because I really believe, I want to, uh, you know, Kanye has obviously told us that he has struggled in the past with bipolar. And sometimes when I see him behave or say some very wild statements, like we just said with the Harriet Tubman thing, um, you know, I bantered at first, but now I'm really just deep in it. I, this is not a banter situation because um, when I'm reading the article, it just, I'm reading the article, when I read the article, it weren't really funny no more. And I think for me, with Kanye's history with mental illness, I think we've got to take this very, very seriously. Um, not only that, um, this is not the first time he's kind of gone on a tangent on a rant. That's been a bit off. Um, also, um, I know the kind of world that he's come from. I don't know it personally, but I know the world he's come from, that when you leave there, you are going to die in some shape or form. Like Hollywood is like the biggest gang you can ever get into, man. Do you know what I mean? The things that they have there, the things that, the things that go on there, that's what he was shouting about, Not you know, in the last, uh, in his music, musical, uh, you know, concert where he's talking about, you don't want Jay-Z to kill him, da 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 you know, I mean, I always say this, there is some truth to what crazy, as what we deem crazy people to say. Um, but yeah, obviously, I'm probably, you're probably waiting to see what actually, what the article says. You're probably looking at, come on, hurry up. Um, but yeah, so let me just read it to you. So Kanye West is credited with Kim Kardashian, is credited Kim Kardashian for making him a father in a presidential rally he tossed Sunday in South Carolina. The 43-year-old star taking the stage at North Charleston Equus uh, Event Center was talking about abortion when he related a personal anecdote of how he handled the situation with the reality star when he told him she was expecting. My girlfriend called me screaming, crying. The Grammy winner told the crowd, I'm a rapper, and she said um, she was crying. I, I just want to play a little bit of it. I'm not going to play all of it because obviously My copyright. Girl. So as you can hear, as you can hear from Kanye, he's breaking down over the situation where he almost aborted his own daughter. Um, so you know, I, I really appreciate. I mean, this is this is a conversation I think we're even having as Christians about our viewpoints on being pro-life, um, or even you can say you know anti-abortion, whichever you want to call it, um, and whether where you stand as a Christian. Um, and you know, I'm, I'm, you know, for me, I think it's such a, it's such a difficult conversation to have because I believe, I believe in the power of giving women choice and autonomy over their body, and even if I don't agree with the choice, the, the, the choice is theirs, you know. So I can't, you know, I'm, I'm a person that says, you know what, I, I don't want to see anyone abort any child, but I have to also be, uh, uh you know, um, give opportunity here to say, listen, hey. 
women should be able to have the freedom to make that choice. Whether someone might class it as murder or a sin, et cetera, et cetera, let that be the case. Um, but what I would say is, you know, that women should have that choice to make it. The reason why I say that is because it's unfair to bring a man. And this is this is a side topic, guys. I know I'm I'm tangenting, I'm tangenting. Um, but it's unfair for us to hold a woman, potentially punish her, you know, legally for aborting a child and not lavishing that same um uh you know uh punishment to the male regardless of whether he whether he agreed to the to the action or not but there should be an equal weight because when y'all were making this child yeah you weren't playing you 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 out here sticking your you, you know your penis in so you felt no way the consequences should be on both parties but actually the accountability lies with the woman and therefore i'm inclined to say because it's her body and it is her decision to make. Um, I know that there's people that he probably won't agree with that and be like, you're a Christian. How can you agree with death? And if I'm like, I I'm listen, as far as I'm concerned, the person has a choice. Now, how you see it is how you see it. Do you know what I mean? Um, but I think there's other hills that we can die on rather than always being so, you know, anti-abortion. There's other things that are human rights out there that y'all ain't fighting, but y'all want to fight this one. Don't make no sense. You know, y'all, 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 y'all be fighting, you know, people doing abortion, but the LGBT community is right there and there. It's, they, you lost that battle. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, let me not talk about that because, you know, Christians be on my neck. But, um, so let me continue. Um, <clears throat> he said, the Bound 2 singer said that God reached out to him in Paris where he was agonizing over whether to have the child. The pair had discussed the possibilities of using a morning after pill while working on his laptop. My screen went blank and why uh, the can't tell me nothing artist told the crowd. And God said, if you F with my vision, I F with yours. And I called my girlfriend and said, we're going to have this child. Cool. That's powerful. Even if my wife were to divorce me after this speech, she brought North into the world when I did not want to. Um, he noted that Kim had the pills in her hand, referencing morning after pills, and told the crowd, I almost killed my daughter. <clears throat> the famous rapper added, no plan B, there is plan A. He noted in the speech that his late mother Donda saved him by resisting his father's overtures to her to get an abortion. The Keeping Up With The Kardashian star, 39, eventually delivered North on June 15, 2013, and a couple have since gone on to welcome son Saint for Psalm 1 and two-year-old daughter Chicago. West declared his candidacy in Independent Day tweet that read, we must now realize the promise of America by trusting God, unifying our vision, building our future. He said he was running for president of the United States against P President Donald Trump and presumed Doc Democratic nominee uh, Joe Biden. An insider told US Weekly that West believes he can bridge between Republicans and Democrats amid the de divisive times. Kanye believes in supporting big business tax breaks, but also more stimulus and opportunities for minorities and black people. The insider um, Todrid class infrastructure projects. So, guys, um, I hope you guys obviously, you know what? I've probably said some controversial things in this by saying about abortion and whether people agree. I mean, I want to I want to have a conversation about it. You know what I mean? Because as a male, I'm very much aware that males, the way we talk about abortion is such, it's from a, such a male perspective. And sometimes I, I'm, and I'm, and I'm appreciating Kanye's point of view here, actually, because, you know, it's, it's, it's for him. It was, it was his daughter that's come out of that. Do you know what I'm saying? So I appreciate that. Um, I guess we'll have a, I guess we'll have a broader conversation with those in, who are affected by this because oftentimes I know that men, you know, are away from the decision because maybe not around or it's not a loving relationship, da 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 da. You know, um I think us men need to be more um aware and be more considerate and have more conversations with our females around this kind of topic to find out the me the mental state, the mindset, what goes through the mind of a woman because a lot of us men are can talk from a place of Oh no, you can't get an abortion. Da, da, da. I'm 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 pro life, etc. I don't know if that's the right even term. Is that the right term? I'm pro life or whatever. Pro you know keeping a child or whatever. Da, da, da. But when that child comes, you ain't there to help support. You ain't there to help support that mother who's now single. You ain't there to help that family when they need help financially, emotionally, spiritually. But you're out here shouting, you know, support the lives and stuff. 
Um, so for me, I'm again, I'm just being, I'm always very careful because I want to get people's understanding and get people's side of things. And I'm I'm also aware that being a male, is, my mind is short sighted. But this is a, this is a separate conversation to what the Kanye thing is really. Do you know what I mean? But I just thought that you know, hopefully people can have a conversation in the, in the comment section. Let me know their kind of thoughts and see what they say. Um, I'm always open for a different point of view. Um, so yeah, guys, make sure you like, share, subscribe, click on that bell button for notification of the uploads. We appreciate you. Say lock, stay loaded.